My fellow San Franciscans, I'm Mike Young, and I want you to join me in creating a unified San Francisco. I'm running for District 7 Supervisor to begin the work of establishing a future vision of San Francisco we can all work towards and be proud of. I was born and raised in San Francisco and graduated from Roosevelt Middle School, Lowell High School, UC Berkeley, and the Harvard Kennedy School of Government. I served for two years as a budget analyst under Mayor Willie Brown and 10 years as a U.S. diplomat in the State Department under Secretaries Powell, Rice, Clinton, and Kerry. I served in South Korea, Afghanistan, Vietnam, Pakistan, and a tour in the Bureau of Counterterrorism in Washington, D.C., where I negotiated bilateral agreements with foreign governments on behalf of the United States. While as a diplomat, I also served concurrently as a U.S. Army officer in the reserves, branch infantry, and airborne qualified. My whole life has been dedicated to public service. After serving our country faithfully for a decade, I wanted to come home to the greatest city in the world and serve the people of San Francisco. What we need now, more than anything else, is to pull together and start work on the legacy we want to leave for the next generation. We need to begin planning now for the next 20 years. Like the rest of America, San Francisco is at a crossroads. In the last two decades, we've witnessed unprecedented growth as a cultural epicenter of the technology revolution. What we created here has had profound effects around the world, and we're now feeling the results of our own success. Newcomers are streaming into San Francisco, bringing new ideas and new ambitions, while old-time residents who built this city are struggling to preserve the neighborhood character that's defined us. Housing prices continue to reach new heights. Our revenues and expenses have swelled Homelessness remains intractable despite disruptive technological innovation, and a wedge has come between our law enforcement and the community. On the west side, crime is up and residents don't feel safe. Property theft from cars is evolving into home burglaries, and residents are afraid it may escalate to home invasions. We simply need more police on the streets and reinvigorated community policing. The west side is also committed to taking on its fair share of growth, but that growth has to be managed. Park Merced alone will add 5,000 additional units over the next 15 years, and we're building more housing on the 17-acre Balboa Reservoir and at Stonestown. With all this new growth coming online, we've got to make plans now for new schools, new hospitals, public transportation, and public safety. But all this will take resources, so we need to keep a close eye on the city finances. A decade ago, when I was in the mayor's budget office, the city budget was $6 billion. Today, that same budget has swollen to $9 billion, but taxpayers don't feel services have improved. We need to make sure we're spending tax dollars wisely and relieve taxes on middle-class property owners who contribute a disproportionate share to city revenues. I want your support. Send me to City Hall so I can first start work on issues important to District 7 and, in doing so, work with other supervisors to build a unified vision we can all be proud of. People around the world look to San Francisco as a place of beauty, openness, and peace. They look to us for inspiration of what could be and what will come. We stand for openness, compassion, courage, and innovation. But to achieve this vision, we have to come together as a city. We have to avoid the divisive talk that plagues our national discourse. We're all Americans first and always San Franciscans at heart. And the first step in building a solid foundation is treating each other with dignity, respect, and honor. That's my vision of a unified San Francisco, and I want you to join me. Let's set an example for the rest of the country to follow. Change may be coming to San Francisco, but by remembering our values and working together, we can preserve our way of life as we boldly go forward into the next decade. And remember, on Election Day, you can rank choice up to three candidates for your district supervisor. A vote for Mike Young is a vote for unity, and I'd like to be your number one vote. Thank you for tuning in, and I look forward to seeing you at the ballot box. Have a great day.